Salutations, this is Grim Devel. Welcome back to our Let's Play of Tavern Tycoon. Lord Peter just entered the building, and hopefully we have a better inspection than we did last time. If this is actually inspection. Uh, we have a little more decor now, and I probably need even more, but our money is getting a little tight, so let's wait. We had a terrible inspection result last time of one. Uh, our knights and uh, wizards do have something to do. I just want to make sure that no one has any moodlit bubbles above their heads. Hello. You, boy. Detention. Detention. See? I'm getting better at uh, spotting those guys. We got 15 reputation for that. Reputation is doing A-OK. -okay. Uh, people are spending money. Our Both of our bars are pretty full. Um, we have at least more people, or we did have more people sitting at the bar than we had capa uh, capacity for one, uh, the capacity of one bar, so it was good that we had two. Does that make sense? Hopefully that made sense, that sentence I just said. Um, okay, don't see any more miners or anything like that. Not a lot going on in here, we just needed the space for our restroom. As we continue to get money, we gotta think about what we want next. We may want research. But we also need to just make sure that we have... The research will require more staff, for one thing. So maybe research isn't really... So far, research has not proven worthwhile. All it's done is take staff away from other things, and we haven't really seen a lot of improvement from it. Reservation for five locals. I'm going to accept this because we have empty tables. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We could get more chairs. If I move this... Okay. Do I want to put more tables on the periphery here? Let's see. Um, I'm looking at the wrong thing. I want furniture. Couple of tables. Can I get one in here? Doesn't look like I can actually fit one here, which is a little disappointing. Because I can't really complete the circle. Like I want. But I can put, I can put them over here. Yeah, I might do that. Maybe... I don't really want one right as you come in. We could put we could put one over here. Even just right there. And then maybe one right here. Okay. And hopefully that's the aura of the stage. Yeah, they I think they're kind of in the aura. We'll see. All right. Some people are reading from the bookshelves, which is nice, sitting down. I probably want more furniture like that when we have a little more money. All right, we'll try Pixie Dust for 200 gold. I don't know if this is anything or if it's just a waste of gold, but it's not a lot. Group of Wizards, seven. Ooh, um, I want to say no. I'm going to say no, because we, we want to be really conservative. We have people sitting here. We want to be really careful. We don't want to drop have our reputation drop like last time. Okay, guest rooms are full, so I think... I will spend a little more money on guest rooms. Um, this one will have to be a bigger one. Oh, I guess I could do like this. I don't know. Um, three by five. Yeah, it can be a little bit bigger, I guess. This will be a. This one will be worth more. Um, good. And this room... This is what we were... We were changing the price when we failed last episode. Can I just... I can't hold my mouse button on it. I have to just keep clicking? That seems kind of ridiculous. We'll just raise this price to 700. Neighboring taverns are interested in trading. Yeah, but that's also something that we never used last time, was the admin functionality. The admin office. It's just, you spend money for things. I mean, maybe it's worth it. Let's see, eight, but three by four, yeah. Boom. Oh, Lord Peter was in there, I see. It's a little awkward. I think we're going to need another um, cleaner. We're just going to keep getting guest rooms right here, though. Because people are staying in them. 
fine. I know it looks a little awkward, but I think it's okay. A lot of guest rooms. We might need another clerk. Everyone, no one is, oh, you took an order. Everyone is okay. Everyone is happy enough. We might need to spread out the tables. Maybe get another stage. Lord Peter left the building. Wow, a lot of messages here. Oh, that's a great monthly report. Even with the expenditure, we're making a lot more income now. Requesting a raise, okay. Oh, that's a tiny, tiny, that's the tiniest raise I've ever seen. Great. You want a more substantial one? That's okay. Knights, eight knights. Ooh. I'm still gonna reject that. That's the locals though, three, yeah, we'll take you. Inspection results, still the interior is the weak point. So I think we just need to buy more. Well, let's hire another handyman. That's one thing. There's vomit all over the place. Anyone that has um, traits? You have a trait. Yeah, let's get you. No time to talk. There's a million things to do. And let's get a chess table and a couple more pots. That'll be a good start. We'll make this symmetric. And I had a pot there. Put a pot here. You know what? Let's put a pot there. And the chess table. Ooh. Perfect. Good. Okay. Hopefully that'll make the ambience a little nicer. I should probably just put more pots kind of everywhere. And book pots and bookshelves and benches, I think. All right. You're leaving. You're incre you left with a reputation change of plus 20. Reputation's doing very well. We have a staff room. And our staff room isn't being used right now. What are you talking about, man? Come on, friend. All right, we got two handymen in, handyman in here. I think it might just be the vomit, though, that was really, boom, squoosh, uh, that that was causing the, the bad interior results. Squoosh. Attention. I hate Attention. You. Yeah, I hate you too, kid. You're not gonna go far in this world. That was a terrible, terrible costume. Um, restrooms are okay. All right, yeah, we got a bunch of handymen in here. And th that was a generous inspection results. Well, I guess what was generous is that we still got positive reputation even though they were terrible inspections. Okay, so regular inspection. Yes, please come inspect again. Uh, okay, good. We still made a profit, even with, um, even with our expenditures. You need a raise. It's a modest raise, and you, raise and you had a very low, in, uh, wage to begin with, so that's fine. Same with you. You're new. Okay. I'm feeling, pr I'm feeling much better about this one. We're playing it a little safer, a little less risky. We're not buying things that I feel like are kind of waste of money. Um, maybe we'll get them when we feel like we actually need them or can afford it. I think that's that's really the ticket. Just wait until we can afford these things. <laughs> it's It seems like a simple concept, but you just want to buy everything all at once. You really do. All right, Lord Peter's here. Please, ho hopefully we'll have a better inspection. We're, we have a bunch of handymen cleaning vomit. We have a little more things we put down. In fact, while you're here, let's get um, a couple more bookshelves, a couple more benches. Maybe a couple more pots. Uh, we'll stick with these for now. We don't want to go crazy. Uh, put a bench here. And um, put a bench here, bookshelf there. And love a bookshelf there, a little symmetry. Okay, nice. Okay, we might want a fire, another fireplace on this entrance too. Just because people hang out over here all the time. People still come in this way, but reputation's already halfway there. Over halfway there. Three locals, I accept. Uh, although I think we need more tables. Do we buy another stage? Maybe I don't buy the stage, but I buy the tables. Let's, let's buy the tables first. Got three tables, and I'm gonna 
put them like so. And eventually I'll probably put another stage over here. So some of these won't be in stage this stage's vicinity. But the stage costs 1200 Yeah, let's wait on that. I want to be a little more conservative about how much we spend. Let's try to keep it above 8500 8, maybe. I think that's a good idea. Ding dong. Eight wizards. I just think that's a bad idea. That's just asking for trouble. We just don't have that many open seats and tables. Maybe they're going to go to other bars, but honestly, who cares? Okay, our one clerk is doing a great job. Are you unhappy for any reason? Yes, you are. Um, let's give you some pay bump. Okay. We might want a second clerk, honestly. Yeah, probably a good idea. Just so she can take a break. Uh, how are you underpaid? Well, your skill is amazing. We don't need that much skill. We'll hire you. Great. Because she was only... We, we didn't have two clerks before. I hear a rat. Where are you, rat? I hear it over here. Oh, Boy, hey. Dismiss. I hate you. <laughs> Gotta get that rat. It's somewhere. I hear it. Oh, there you are. Squoosh. Okay. Cool. Lord Peter is coming up here. Everything looks nice and clean over here. Although, there are no plants or anything over here. We could change that. It's pretty plain. But again, we want to be sane with our money. You're hungry. Okay. If you're hungry... Uh, oh, we don't have enough tables? And maybe the people are sitting... Let's hire another barmaid. People might not be served fast enough. And you're fast. Fine day, isn't it? I think we will need more tables, but I think we just need more barmaids so these people are served faster and get out of here faster. We need faster turnaround is the ticket. Okay. I might even want a, yet another barmaid. Maybe that... I think that might have been four nights? I'm going to accept this reservation. I'm going to hire another barmaid. And let's try to go... I think we just need tons of barmaids. That might be a mistake that we made. It's just not hiring enough barmaids. I thought we had plenty. But I think people just weren't... There just wasn't fast enough turnaround service. This is great. Good income. Okay. You need a raise. That's acceptable. You're a new hire. Okay, we got cooking going on. It seems as soon as you cook, you serve. Is that how it works? It is too bad the kitchen's so far away. That maybe wasn't the smartest thing, but I think as long as we have these barmaids, it's going to be okay. All right, I'm not seeing any hungry bubbles right now. Here come the new knights. Um, can I, let's maybe, how much does a new stage cost? 1200 we can afford it. Maybe get you in right there. Oh, I should have turned it around the other way. That's uh, fine. I just, I thought the stairs, stairs inward, you know? Actually, I can do that. Great. And now I can build more, a couple more um, tables. Okay, cool. And can I afford another fireplace? They are expensive, but we have money right now, and I think it'll be nice. 
Uh, I can't really fit it in right there. Although, you know what? As they kind of... Would that be nice? I could move this table backwards, but someone's sitting at it now. I just don't know. I mean, people do move through that door. But it would improve our decor. I'm gonna do it. Okay. Lord Peter, how you doing? I, I can never see how Lord what Lord Peter is thinking. Um, I might be able to fit another guest room in here, maybe, but I, it's it's pretty good. This one's more expensive. Money's doing okay. You are making an order. You're hungry. Do I want to hire more barmaids? The other thing is, um, the bookshelves. They cost money, right, for people to use them. And they probably increase decor. We got people leveling up. That's awesome. Okay. Um, what's going on? Group reservation locals, five. Um, hold on. Do I want to do that? I think for now, no. I think I'm going to say no to that right now. Until we get some empty tables. And maybe I'm gonna hire another barmaid. More barmaids. That's the key. That's what I'm saying might be the key. You have low potential. You have more potential. Let's get you. Salutations. What is this? Oh. Yeah, re repair. I guess we need maybe another handyman as well. Uh, we have a bunch of options now. You're way overpaid. Let's not get someone that overpaid. I'd like to get someone with the... Okay, we'll hire you. Hello. Lord Peter left. I hear a rat, though. Where is it? Squoosh! Let's take a look for miners. Do a little miner scan. Lord Peter's leaving. Oh, you want books? Do we not have enough bookshelves? Interesting. We have money, though. Inspection results, 3.3. Boom, we've definitely fixed our interior. Hygiene and meat quality is great, which is funny because we have no research at all. Uh, dining quality is fine. Work environment is good. Okay. Reputation. Wow, look at a reputation. It's almost all the way up there. Um, oh, I just got a, an achievement. Everything is on special, which you can't see for some reason. I thought I... I thought you could see my Steam achievements these days, but I guess not that one. Um, no. New job offer. So we did it? We did it! We beat the scenario! That was so... I, I did it just by not... My tavern, my rules. Just by not doing stupid things. Just by not buying things I didn't need. And just going slowly and steadily and not taking risks. Which wasn't as much fun, I gotta say, but... That's how you play the game. That's... How you actually win and get ahead. We're in the desert? Welcome to the wealthier part of town. Build a research workshop to improve and develop your menu. Be ready to handle more guests than you're used to. Unhappy guests will ruin your reputation, so be wise about accepting group reservations. Yeah, we learned that lesson last time. 700 reputation, 90,000 tavern value, and keep our finances above 5,000, just like last time. You will be fired if the tavern goes under. Okay. Okay, first things first. We buy a clock. And, um, fine, and then we can pause it. Okay, let's take a look at what we're working with here. Three buildings, and they're all very nicely shaped. Not oblong at all. Um, 12,000 to buy these things. I'll probably want to buy some right away. Um, let's, you know, be sane. This one's going to be tricky. Locals are into spa nowadays, wink, wink. Uh, you might send a few of your friends, so you hope our tavern is big enough to handle them. So we can build new rooms, including a spa. Okay. That's the only new room is the spa. It is very expensive. It is twice as expensive as Arcane Studies and Gymnasiums. Uh, is there new furniture we can make? I don't notice any new... Oh, a piano! It is very expensive. 
but it probably does the same thing as the stage. And it has a, be a better radius than the stage. Okay. Okay. We, this is an interesting layout. I assume people are going to come in through here. We're going to do our stand. We're still going to get a fireplace at the entrance. Always. That's how we start. Okay. And... Let's get that piano right away. I know it's expensive, but I want to buy it first. Wow. Yeah, look at that radius. Are these buildings... I can't get into those buildings. But those buildings are probably not going to be bar buildings. Let's put you right here. That's a really nice radius. And we will put stuff around it. We will put a bar. Uh, no, I do want... I want furniture. We're going to get a bar really close to it. Perfect. Okay. And tables. Oh, okay. Hmm. Just want you as close as possible. Ah. I guess. Okay. I like kind of having a haphazard, asymmetric seating. Uh, although, I, try, you know, we want to also be efficient. Let's hire some folks. We'll hire a bartender. Someone that is... Oh, wait. Wait, what was that? Guests will always pay tip. Wow. Yeah. Let's try that. Although the other guy sounds awesome, too. I might want to hire both of them immediately while they're available. Two bartenders. Maybe that's dumb. And let's get a maiden. Oh. And you have the tip one too. Wow. Let's hire you both as well. Not used to the hustle and bustle, are you? We'll hire a handyman. We'll hire the fast one. These traits, I think, are really useful. And uh, that's going to be okay for now. Let's name... Our franchise, Grimm's Gragatorium. Because I am not creative. And unpause it. And we'll, of course, have to make restrooms, staff rooms, all that stuff. But I think we're going to do all that next episode. So thanks for watching, everybody. I really enjoyed playing with you today. Excited about Scenario 3. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye.